day 11 I'm going to go swimming again <laughs> I'm going to try and swim six kilometers to be honest I don't feel very good uh, today I uh, I overheated yesterday during the swim during the seven kilometer afternoon swim and um, I'm not feeling very good uh, today a combination of maybe uh, you know getting very tired getting too hot Got to be very careful of uh, heat exhaustion. Um, so, going to be monitoring that very carefully today. It's just uh, very difficult to recover on board this boat because it's so hot in between swims. Definitely not in the bag at all. Um, nice to go on shore just now see the folks and of course natural questions when you're going to finish when you're going to finish when you're going to finish um, day after day of punching out 10 kilometers a day which is equivalent to running a marathon every single day and then recovering on this boat are starting to take its toll on me uh, my shoulders are fine but um, yesterday I got baked in that seven kilometer swim in the afternoon I overheated um, and it's taken its toll on me today so now more than ever, I need all of your support. Um, the target each day is 10 kilometers. That's all. Anything over that is a bonus. So I just need you guys to focus on 10 kilometers a day. And the most important thing is when I come up off the boat is I have to be able to recover better than I've done in the last couple of days. I've got to get cooler. I need more shade. Um, because I can't keep going um, like I'm going at the moment because I'm overheating and I'm very concerned about heating. It's day 11, uh, 1.30 in the afternoon. Couldn't be much hotter at this particular time, but uh, this is when the tides are right. I'm about to go in the water and see if I can knock out another six kilometers. See you soon. Problem we've got at the moment, we're going to have a lot of uh, recreational boats around, not jet skis. We've also got the working fishing boats coming through here. It's quite a narrow channel, so we've got to make sure we give um, Ax some protection whilst he's in the water. That's why we've got two kayaks in close to him, and uh, we're obviously trying to fend off any other boat. There we go. That was uh, two hours and 40 minutes of being of running into jellyfish. This water here is just full of these big pink jellyfish. I've got a GoPro shot of one of them. When I hit them with my hands they don't hurt, but I ran into one like, head first and it stung my forehead and my nose. It's towards the end, so uh, if you hit them in the right place they do sting a little bit. Six and a half kilometers down on that ship. It's a total of... Uh, 82 kilometers down. Not bad. It's going to recharge before we get out on the night shift. It's going to be fun tonight, swimming in the dark, bumping into jellyfish. Made a big session. There's lots going on. Started off scorching hot. And then we got into quite a busy tourist area. So there's jet skis and boats and fishermen catching jellies going everywhere. So there's a lot going on above the water. And just trying to keep Axe safe because he can't see what's going on. He definitely heard it challenging session. We uh, need a bit of a rest before we go again tonight. 